We're at the Good Food and Wine Show. It's on all weekend and we've caught up with the one and only MasterChef host and judge, George Calambaris. Hey, George. How are you? What is your definition of good food? Good food is, is not just about the flavour and the taste, it's about the experience. So, you know, it's about the place, the time, the weather, the feeling, the, the smell. It's all of those things captured together. And when they're all working in sync, it's like heaven. Now, um, obviously, you know, your profile has been elevated over the years on MasterChef. Are you still adjusting to this sense of celebrity and people just want, want to pick your brain about everything to do with food? Yeah, totally, totally. I, but I think what's lovely is, uh, you know, I just finished a, a private dining room where we cook for 16 people. And, you know, I'm, I'm in there touching, feeling, cooking, cutting, and you, you, know, you never forget who you are and what you do. So that's what's lovely about my job. You know, yes, I'm on TV and yes, people know me, but I'm still a cook and a chef. Okay. And um, obviously with a, a young son, I believe he's got his first birthday coming up. Very are you more sure. conscious of what you, you know, what we're feeding our kids and are people sort of approaching you about that as well? Yeah, 100%. You know, I think, you know, uh, I don't feed James anything out of a can, anything processed, n none of that, because that's how I was brought up. Um, and there's no excuse. It's quite quite simple to take uh, a fresh pumpkin and make pumpkin, pumpkin puree. It's, you don't need to be a genius. Um, it, and it's too easy just to grab it off the shelf. Um, cook fresh and, and, and give your child or children um, healthy food. And with um, uh, recent uh, observations, you know, about Jamie Oliver, who I adore and I think is brilliant, he got a bit of grief about, you know, piling on a few pounds. I mean, is it hard not to you know, get huge in this business? Oh, of course. I mean, I mean that's ridiculous. He, he, lo he, he looks fantastic. Um, but we are in the food industry and, and we taste and we eat and we, that's what we do. I love it. Uh, you take my taste buds away from me, kill me. You know, I might as well not be on earth. Um, so, yeah, look, you know, this is, all, this is all good. It's all good stuff in here. And um, last year I, I had a bit of a chat with Manu, yep. okay, and um, I, I asked him this question, so I'm going to ask you the same question, okay? Yeah. Have you ever cooked in the nude? <laughs> what did he say? Yes. No. Yes. Wait till and he I elaborated. see him. Wait till I see him. No, I've never cooked in the nude. Never. Not just a little apron on no, or something? No, no. I, I need to give that a go. I might go and get some tips off Manu. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you so much. And um, looking forward to this weekend, you know, what's the best thing about this, you know, this event? You know what's lovely is you, you're demonstrating to an open forum. There's people in front of you. It's live. There's no commercial breaks. And it's us chefs being chefs. So it's an amazing weekend. You know, it kicks off here in Melbourne and we do the whole tour of the country. So um, look out. It's going to be cool. Thank you. Thank you.